Alrighty, welcome back to a brand new video, guys. Thank you for stopping by. This is going to be another episode of Fake Glove Touch Karma. Now, my plan was to make this once a month, but looking at how many submissions I've gotten, man, I'm thinking that I might just make this thing twice a month. Because there's, I mean, you guys keep sending in videos over and over again. I never expected that there will be that many instances of of, of 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 fake glove touch and lead into a karma i never i never thought that would happen but um it seems we've got a lot of footage and i want to make sure that i get everyone's uh submission in so without wasting too much time let's jump right into this one again i'm thinking i'm going to make this twice a month but we'll see how it goes First one is from user Fearless Six God. He is using John Bones Jones, I believe. Oh my God, he gets hit right there. John Jones gets put in the single collar clinch. Muay Thai Plum. He's gonna land a knee right there, I believe so. I think he gets taken down from here. John Jones gets him right down. Bam into guard. If there's anyone that you don't want to be fake glove touching, it's definitely John Bones Jones, especially when you don't want to be on the ground. You understand? So. John Jones makes his way to side control right there. Control. Gustafson on the bottom. And let's see what this player does. Let's see how he handles being taken down. I mean, you're gonna fake glove touch. Let's see what happens when, when the pain begins. Gets him in crucifix. He tries to get out. He can't get out. He's trying to get out. John's gonna land one elbow and look what he does. He quits. Typical, typical, he quits. Let's jump into the next one. Second one is from a user named Dark Shadow 727650. Bro, come, what, what's up with your name, dude? What's up with your name? Anyways, look at this combination. Drops him with a spinning back fist. Bam, bam, he gets on top. Can Connor survive? Nope, that was quick. Jesus Christ, that one was really, really, really quick. If you're gonna fake glove touch, at least last a few minutes in the fight. Come on, what are you doing? Let's jump into the next one anyways. Hopefully not a guy with a long name. Right there, homeboy. Homeboy. Gets hit with a flying knee to the body. Gets hit with a crane kick. That's 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 two. That's two strikes right there. Two strikes right there. Let's see if he pays for it. He gets hurt. Uppercut City. Pushing him back against the cage. Gets him in a Muay Thai knee. Lands a knee. He's going to get on top and pound him out. Oh, my God, bro. Usually, man, when when you get fake glove touch like that, they usually go for a flying knee or a crane kick or a head kick. It seems those are the three strikes you mostly see. Flying knee, either to the head or to the body, head kick or a crane kick. And uh, homeboy made this, he, he made this dude pay. I believe we have one more fight right there. One more from homeboy. Let's see how long this one lasts. Fake glove touch again. Flying knee to the body. The same exact, the same exact kick, the same exact strike that he got hit with in the last fight. He gets him in the, in the Muay Thai plum. Let's see if he's able to finish him this time. Bam, takes him to the ground. That's a beautiful takedown animation. He's in backside, landing a few strikes. Side control. He gets reversed. Very interesting. Dude, I, it's been a long time since I saw that reversal. Almost forgot it's in, it's in the actual game. <laughs> he gets hit. With an axe kick and knocks him right back down. Muay Thai Plum. He's able to escape Muay Thai Plum. Let's see what happens here. Gets him in the, in the Muay Thai Plum against the cage. He escapes. Okay. Hook, hook. Bam. Look at that. Hits him in the body with a beautiful kick. Roundhouse to the body. This is a longer fight here. Let's see what happens. Let's see what he gets him with. He gets tripped. He gets tripped on his back again. Get up, boy. Get up, homeboy. Parries that one. Now he's in Southpaw. He started this fight in, in conventional, I believe so. I might be wrong. But right there, he's got him in the Muay Thai plum. He makes his way back to single collar. Let's see what happens here. He takes him down. Big slam into mount. Is he going to pound him out right here? Tries to escape. Does not work. Landed a few elbows, you know, just softening up, softening him up a little bit, getting ready for the big shots. He makes his way to side control, actually side saddle. See what happens here. Ooh, he actually gets up. Gets right back up, back to standing. 
<laughs> that stance is so hilarious when they're moving. That their hand just stays stays still as they're moving forward. The same exact takedown slams him into full mount. I believe right here is where he makes him pay. Bam! Look at these shots. Taking his time. He's not rushing anything. Just taking the sweet time and hitting him every time he tries to move. But right there, he gets arm trap. Look at what he does right there. He lets him reverse him to guard and gets him right back to mount. That's smart. That's high level stuff. He's going to posture up again. An elbow, hook, straight, straight, and the fight is over. Don't be fake love touching, man. Don't be doing that, especially not against the dude named Homeboy. That happens. You get pounded out. Top mount right there. Bam. 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 Next fight. Username Marquise Harris. Look at this one. I believe he was talking here, so we'll let him talk. Oh. Nice job with the right hand. Don't run now. You did that shit, man. <laughs> Dude's taunting. Nice jab. jab, jab, jab. Look it's at him taunting. For what you did, though. Great job. Oh, this is a nice kick. Head kick. Nice head kick. That punch was blocked. Huge uppercut. uppercut. Big shots. Oh, I believe he got parried right there. Bam! He's hurt. Oh! Yeah. Marshall <laughs> Madden. Marshall Mine, I mean. It's over, bro. Marshall Mine. It's over. Sending that shit, man. I'm sending <laughs> that shit, man. Beautiful. All right. And I believe this is the last fight that I've got for you guys. User named Tachanka. He dodges that one. He, he, do he He's using Sakuraba. He anticipated. It's almost like he knew a fake glove, a fake glove touch was coming. So he, he ducked that one. Now he's on the bottom. I mean, when you're using Sakuraba, when you're facing Sakuraba, watch out for those submissions. Watch out for those submissions. Gets him in sight control. Right now, Uriah Hall is still on top. Still, still doing his thing. Still doing his thing. He gets right back up to his feet. Lands a crane kick. They just love these damn crane kicks. Oh, my God. Uriah does not have any stamina. I believe he gets taken down right there. Single collar into a Kimura. Here we go. Is he going to get it? Is he going to get it? Watch out for that green bar. Ooh, he switches to an arm bar. This fight's done. It is over. And it is all over. That's it. That's done. Fake glove touch karma ladies and gentlemen this this is one of my absolute favorite kind of video to make i love seeing how you you players react when you start a fight and someone does that because i mean if you're not used to it if it ha if it hasn't happened to you a lot it can be pretty frustrating it can really really get you off your game especially when you're trying to be nice you're trying to be respectful trying to f i mean i get i understand it's a video game it's just a video game so you shouldn't really take it that seriously but man if, I, if i'm trying to touch your gloves and you hit me uh, you know if, if i can I'm, I'm i'm really gonna make your life a living hell after that so I really appreciate all the submissions. Keep them coming in. Like I said, I'm going to inc I'm going to increase this to twice a month. And oh my god, I can't wait for UFC three and EA Sports UFC three. We're gonna keep this thing going. Oh my god, send send all the videos. I'm gonna leave my email in the description below. Keep sending me your clips. And there's a chance that you're going to make it in the next episode. But thank you so much for watching. means a lot. I will see you guys in the next one. As always, keep yourself safe and have a wonderful day.